Yeet, the rapper that struck popular in mid-2021 when his song Sorry About That rose to fame in TikTok. Yeet would live in Portland, Oregon his whole life until he graduated to move to New York for his rapping career. And oh my god, that was the best decision he's ever made. Well, if you don't know something about Yeet and why he's so popular now is because his style of music is a bit different from the rest of the rappers. Well, at least different to the point where his raw vocals are like this. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, yo! I me up! Race! Race! No way. Besides those weird ass raw ab libs, uh, people seem to love him. If you dig into him a bit more, you can tell why, because he has quantity and quality. Which is a good thing because some rappers last album or single are like back in 2018, unfortunately. But as I said earlier, the reason why he's so popular now is because how different he is from the rest. Like, I mean, if you find another rapper just like him, I'll give you some, uh, I don't know, Robux or something. I don't care. And you might be thinking to yourself, well, Hoopa, just because he's different doesn't mean he's going to be good or better. And it's not going to change anything. Well, you'd be completely wrong. See, now, this is where I get classical Hoopa to prove you wrong. All right, so to you scattywags who think music never changes, this is what I have to say to you. Music has been changing for so damn long, you will probably only existed for the 21st century because there are six classified ones as medieval, renaissance, baroque, classical, romantic, and our current one. And you're going to have to trust classic Koopa here. They all sound very different. And yes, before you guys start bickering at me, I know that is a music period that is way different compared to one genre. But what I'm trying to say in general is that music changes no matter what. And with music changing so much that it can't even catch up to itself, there was going to be obvious that there was going to be another artist that would pop up and become popular with a different style. And this is exactly what Yeet did. He showed up and he conquered. That's all I have to say. And with his future album coming out called Afterlife, he's only going to change up everything more. And speaking Speaking about this album, there's actually hundreds of thousands of people actually excited for this album coming up, which shows how big he is. And I promise you, when this album releases, it's going to show that the genre is going to change really quick and a lot of people are going to take inspiration from it. Um, yeah, don't ask why I'm like kneeling on my floor right now when I have like a perfectly good, good chair right here. Every time when I sit in that damn chair, I look zesty as fuck, alright? I don't want to sit in that chair right now. But yeah, what I wanted to say was, I was going to do a yeet part right here. You don't see that, obvious, because I don't have anything, unfortunate. But yeah, I will do more, I'll do more skits and stuff since you literally know what I look like now. And that was basically the video, if you like it, like, I mean, give it a like or whatever, whatever you want to do. Like, I mean, you're the one in charge, not me. But yeah, like, I'll see you later.